is Evan from the OVR and today I'm going to show you how to set up K2 Pro for POV shooting. Here we have two solutions for you. The first is cheaper system, which one you can find in every platform like Amazon or eBay. It's a cost you around like a hundred dollars and it can cover every position for POV shooting, including seating, standing, laying down and if you want to sound special, it's have to work too. And here have a little bit more expensive platform for shooting. It's a combo arm, doesn't matter what brand is it. It can be like a Matthews, American Greek. And uh, which important here, it's a Matthews mini boom arm. I, I tried to find something similar on the market, but for me it looks like a Matthews, it's a, like a best solution for VR shooting. So here I have a Cape Pro and now I'm going to show you how to set it up. As you can see, we use a special cables. Uh, it's cables from the Elvin brand, and just the one big difference between original K2 Pro cables and these cables, these cables, it's, uh, as you can see, it's angular cables. So, it gives you a little bit more space for your, because sometimes you have to put camera super close to the actor face, and uh, it's kind of not comfortable with the cables. Longer. So first what you need for the VR shooting is some ball head, similar with this. I prefer to use something with a uh, level inside, which one easier. You have to just put the ball head inside the camera. Make sure you didn't go full because it's giving a little bit more space for the your avatar. So next one. You're gonna need this uh, goba, goba head. So I'll just put this bit inside. It's have to look like this. Now, for example, for standing position, I just have to put it here. Make sure the well was good. And for example, you need like a standing view. So, so what important stuff here, it's a camera have to be on the one eye line with your eyes. So serve this and then in the white. So now your standing view is ready. For example, you want a sitting. This, move down, and again, right. same stuff. Just sit here, go back, a little bit adjust. Now it's your sitting position. So, same with the weight now. For this system, it's more work same. actually work pretty the same. You put it here and you have to adjust your angles and high high if you want this. It's a little bit more stable but you can uh, put a lot of sandbags and it's have to work. For the kit to pro we have to use two iPads. I found this stuff on Amazon at $16 price mount and it's works great for the reading. You can see it's here. I already have one iPad, but if you need the second one, you just grab it and you can use new camera control set. Also, I want to show some light solution for you today. Original Studios use a huge soft box. I recommend it to use these quasar size tubes. I originally use 4 feet tubes, crossfade. It's super good. If you shot in a bright room, for example, it's give you just put two of these tubes inside and it gives you a lot of lights. Because one of these tubes two work like a four tank skinner form. So it's have to do. Also here you can easily adjust the white balance. You have to like put it in the back of the camera, sometimes it can a little bit visible on your frame. With this quasar, it's a hundred percent warranted to be good on set. Thank you guys for watching me and uh, I believe this video is going to help you to enjoy POV shooting 
Peace, Dale, Bear.